Hello everyone. This is Ivina from Lalaland Crafts. Today is Saturday, November 28th, and we are. Oh, oops, sorry about that. <laughs> Just trying to see what's on the what you guys see and didn't have the volume off. Hi Katya, Esmeralda, Taya. Hi everybody. So, um, oops, let me move this out of the way a little bit. Not time just yet. So, um, this is our limited edition winter box reveal uh, live. And this time the box will be white, just white box like this. So, for those of you who have been getting our boxes, you know that we had them printed before, but this time uh, for this box, it will be just the white box. So it could be better if you um, don't want people to know what's coming, I guess. <laughs> That's the upside. And um, it's still the same size box. It's still the same quality box. I was going to stamp on it to make it more decorative, but you guys have been shopping and I'm sorry, but I can't hand step on that many boxes. So you're just gonna have a shipping label here and this is the box you're going to get this time. Um, this box is winter themed and um, all of the products that are in the box, the box is limited edition, but all of the products that are in the box will be added to our regular range and you'll be happy to know that you won't have to long, wait long to see samples from our design team because we are going to have our release on Monday. So you, you only have to wait two more slips until the release day and then you'll see so many amazing samples from our design team. And by the time you get your box, you'll, you'll have so many ideas of what to do with all of this. So, here are, um, Elizabeth is asking if it's too late to order this box. Elizabeth, yes, we um, actually sold out on the pre-order. So um, usually we do pre-orders and then once we reveal it, we still give you time. Well, you know, if there are boxes left, then you still can order it at the little higher price. But this time we have sold out on the pre-order. So I'm sorry, but um, I know I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm like, I know you want to see what's in there, but I want to tell you that there is something to look forward to in January. So there'll be another box in January. So if you um, love our boxes, be on the lookout for the pre-orders for that. Okay, so let's go ahead and open this baby here. And you have, first of all, you have the letter that shows you, well, it says thank you from us. And then it shows you everything that's included in your box. And um, this list does not include another die that was um, for pre-orders, the extra die that was a gift. It's not included here. So you'll see that you have one extra. It in, will be included in your box, but um, it's not included on the list. Elizabeth, you lost the signal and yes, I did see See your question and I did answer it already. We we have sold out on pre-orders, so unfortunately there is no more of this box, but the products that are included in this box will be released into the regular range on Monday. So if you see something that you like here, you'll be able to, to order it on Monday, starting Monday. Okay, so it's, um, it's not holiday themed, it's winter themed, but products can be used. You know how we always try to, make products that you can use for different occasions. So you'll be able to use them for holidays as well as just for any winter, other winter occasions. So, uh, should I undo this? Okay, so I'm really, there, there are some products here that are my all time favorites and I can't wait for you to see it. I am going to start from the, kind of from the bottom. So. I want to show you the paper pack. And um, you know, in the, in the boxes, we give you a sampler, sampler pack. So this is from Home for Christmas paper pack. 
So the full paper pack has, has um, 24 papers, double-sided papers. So your, your sampler pack will have 12, one of each of the double-sided papers. And let me show you how gorgeous these papers are. So I'm going to go kind of slow so you can see the design and the colors. And these are kind of vintage, soft, like shabby chic, but you know, blues, just kind of really, really amazing colors on these papers that you can mix and match and, you know, pick other papers to go with this. They'll go well with the ivory and with the browns. Look at these papers, look at this design. It, isn't this gorgeous? Just love it. This more Christmas one. So it, it's, you know, the, the paper is called um, home for Christmas, but of course there are some that are just wintery pages that you can, or, or designs that you can use for other occasions. And of course the front and back, look how gorgeous it is. And then, so there we had some um, blue and white kind of and brown, so now we're in two reds. Isn't it gorgeous? Look at the snowflakes, just stunning. So I'm showing you the front and back so you can see how the papers look like. And I can see, so it's dark here right now. It's, it's five o'clock where you are um, on the East Coast, it's probably eight o'clock, or if you are um, international from different country, probably in the morning right now. Look at this, isn't it gorgeous? So the, um, I had to turn on the light. So. It, Sorry if you have a little bit of the glare, but our papers, they have a sheen to them, so they're not glossy. It might look like like too glossy kind of, but they just have a little sheen. They're kind of little dresser. And look at these papers. Look at this. And um, I know I should not be saying that, but if you are Club La La Land Craft subscriber, these papers, you'll be able to use these papers with the uh with the december kit too so be be on the lookout for that uh, michelle is asking if you missed the pre-order yes i'm so sorry michelle the, the pre-order is over and we're actually sold out on the pre-orders this time but as i mentioned before um just a few minutes ago if you're just now joining us we'll have another box in january so be on the lookout for that so this is this will be the sampler pack one of each papers that's the first thing in your box. Then I want to show you a stencil set. And this one is called On the Wall. And it comes as a set of two. And one of them is this gorgeous stone work, like um, cobblestones kind of design. And then the bricks. I've always loved the bricks design and I'm so happy that we finally have a stencil and I can show you a little bit while I'm going through this what I did here with this stencil so I only had and I'm lucky I found it I only had this um what do you call it the paste and it's crackling and it's transparent so um what I did here you can see it's kind of crackled, but I just wanted to show you the design. Of course, you can use anything, um, any paste, but I wanted to have more dimension. And what I did here, I, because it's transparent and I wanted a little bit of the color, I mixed it with um, some Oxide ink. So I just spread Oxide ink and then mix it with that to give it a little bit of color. I could have gone a little darker, but this is what I have here, so you can see. And this is white on white, and I put I think it's still dry and I can still feel it's a little wet. It's been a little over an hour, but it's, I, I guess it's, it takes a long time to dry for it. And then um, when it was wet, I put glitter on it so you can see how gorgeous this is. And it's sparkly, so pretty. And then this is just regular stenciling. And this is the, the, the stones. Look how gorgeous they are. This is just so, so pretty. So um, this is the stencil set. Excited, excited about this, excited about that. I'm excited about so many things here. Now let me show you this 
So what am I gonna show you next? I think I'm gonna show you clear stamp set. Look at this. Look how cute these critters are. And I have some colored versions here to show you. So first we have the piggies. The piggies are back and this stance, uh, I'm sorry, this clear stamp set is called Dashing Through and it has four piggies that are enjoying winter time. Look how cute they are. So cute. And I colored them kind of in the colors of the, of the papers so you can use them together. Look, oh, look how pretty. Look, this is, this is so, so pretty. Look at him so pretty so the sentiments here are happiest of holidays so as i said you can use it for the holidays winter is here dashing through the snow and then you have sliding by to say hi or you can do sliding by to wish you happiest of holidays so happiest of holidays you can use on its own or you can combine it with the other ones so these are the piggies, cute, cute, cute. And then we have, and again, if you are our club subscriber, you already familiar with this character, with these bears. And once we designed them for the club, I just could not stop. I just, I just love how these bears turn out. So you get the full set of these winter bears. That's, that's the name of the set. And we have four of them. So holding a cup here with the skis, um, with the shell, with the snow, and then this one. I colored him in the, in the Christmas colors, but of course he can just wear like winter hat. It doesn't have to be white uh, or a uh, uh, red hat right here. And the sentiments are sending warm and cozy hugs. Look, because the papers are so cozy, right? Look at this. So you can use so many different papers with this, right? And just so, so pretty. And um, miss you snow much, so play on words on snow. And then we have everything is cooler with you. So um, I colored these bears here as um, like, um, what do you call it? Like the uh, woodland bear, or I guess like the ones that, that live in the woods. <laughs> And then I colored this one right here look like a polar bear. So he can be a polar bear as well. So you can color them however you prefer, however it works for your project. And as I said, our design team is going to start showing their projects with this release on Monday. And there'll be so many other different ideas on how to color the images. And um, of course the projects, it, it will be fun. So. Um, these are the two clear stem sets. And then, of course, we have Marcy. And you can probably see her right there. Look, she's speaking. <laughs> she, Marcy is speaking. And this is our Marcy. And I love her. Look at her. Look at her. Look how beautiful she is. So, this is a rubber stamp. And if you're not familiar with our rubber stamps, there are already mounted on foam and on the clean mount. So all you need to do is remove the backing and then you put it on your acrylic block and you can stamp it like that. You can keep the backing paper and put it back on for storage you prefer. Now the stamp comes with three sentiments and you'll need to cut it apart so you can stamp Marcy and the sentiment separate. I know some, um, some of you keep it together and stamp just stamp it once you can do that way as well Vivian is asking if this Marcy was in the retreat box Vivian no you had another stamp and we're not going to say which one now because uh, the release is going to be on Monday but nothing from here was included in your if for those of you who participated in our craft retreat a few weeks ago, none of these products were included with your, with your um, retreat projects. This is all new. So as you can see, this is the size of Marcy and the sentiments, I have them cut, cut out here somewhere. 
made okay here they are here are they are i love the sentiments too so we have hot coca is like a hug from the inside so see how she's holding the mug then we have wishing you a season filled with sweetness and then the third sentiment is hot hot chocolate kind of day so we have three sentiments to go with this marcy and of course you can mix and match the sentiments with other images so you can use hot chocolate kind of day with this bear too the one that's holding the coffee cup or it could be hot chocolate whatever you you make it to be so this is our marcy stem and then we have two dies that are the box dies plus because all of you who pre-ordered are getting the extra dies so these two dies are included in the value of the kit so this right here ski lift and ski lodge this is what makes this box 130 dollars with all of these products this die right here the skis is your additional die so this is your free die that's not included in the value if you include the value of this die it brings the box kit to 145 dollars and remember that you paid 69.99 so you're getting this all of this 50 percent off i just wanted to bring this up i know you guys all know that already but kind of wanted to mention to give you an idea or for those of you who are new and just watching it right now if you're not familiar with our boxes just be on the lookout for the next one we do boxes four times a year our next one will be in january probably at the end of the january but this is what kind of value you get with our products and these are all full-size products that are the same quality that we do in our regular range okay so let's go through the dies so this this one right here as i as i mentioned is the is the additional die the bonus die for those of you who pre-ordered and this is the skis and i am while i'm talking to you <laughs> i'm trying to find where i die cut them okay so if you would like to know the size I know you, you, some of you like seeing how big the dies are. This die measures three and three quarters long, right here. And you can see it has detail, the stitch detail. Isn't pretty? So I, this is die cut from chipboard. This is die cut from a white card stock. Um, I have another question if it's too late to order this box right now. It is too late, unfortunately, because we are sold out on pre-orders. Um, pre-orders were open more than for for longer than two weeks and now we're sold out but the products from this box will also be part of our release um, new release on monday um, there'll be more than this so even if you got the box make sure you 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 uh, check out the release and see what else is there because you know all of our products coordinate uh, but yes this box is sold out already okay so these are the skis that you get the extra die and then for the ski lift the die is like this so this is the die and it's a border die but it doesn't have the bottom to it so when you die cut it it's about five inches wide tomorrow monday Jackie, are you, no, today is Saturday, so tomorrow is Sunday. Jackie, is, I think you're playing with me, but, uh, or I, uh, but yeah, tomorrow is not Monday, tomorrow is Sunday, so I have one more day to get ready for Monday. Um, so this die does not have the bottom, which means, which means that you can make this layer as tall or as short as you would like so you would cut your paper to the size and then you can line up your die and die cut it like this so as you can see i have here a few um let me put it against craft cardstock so this one is shorter right and then you can put marcy sitting right here isn't it pretty or you can do your critters isn't it awesome 
So really, really cool. Dina is saying it's perfect for you, Dina. I was thinking of you when we were designing this kit. So, um, so this one is shorter. This one is longer. I left it like this, longer. Just have a bottom of it open so you can do just the sentiment. You can do other things here and um, it's just a really fun thing to do. You can also do, I know the slim line cards are popular right now. So I cut this layer long and just die cut part of my border right here. And look how fun this is. This is just amazing, right? So look, and you can do the sentiment, you can stencil, you can stamp, and that will make a cute, cute card, right? So easy and just perfect. So that's one of the dies that's in, dies that included in your kit. And then the other die is the is the skid lodge. And it's really, really cool die. Um, I have one right here open. So as you can see, it has a lot of detail. So it has brick here, it has the lines there. It, and it, then it comes with the two parts that are actually part of the roof that you can layer. And I have one die cut here and actually I have one die cut from chipboard. And when you die cut from chipboard, because chipboard is thicker, the, the pieces actually are staying in and you can use it this way. And then I can show you, I didn't put it together because I wanted to show you. So this is die cut from cardstock. And as you can see, the pieces all came out. So then you can color, um, you can coordinate, you can cut it from different colors and you can mix and match in these different elements. So you can put, um, you can die cut it from different colors and inlay it, or you can do it like I did and die cut it from, from chipboard first. And then let me put it together right now while I am here with you so we can all see how this works. So the chipboard is the kind of, medium medium weight chipboard and this is the chipboard that we have in our online store that we use all the time and it cuts as you can see so clean through the with our dies through this chipboard just trying to see to open this so i'm just going to i'm just going to line it up and and layer it or should i or should i just leave it as a chipboard and add you know what i'm gonna go I'm gonna go with this. I think I'm just gonna give it white elements and leave the and leave it um, as a chipboard on the on the base. So just to give you different ideas. And look, you can use your brick stencil. It's it's a larger size, but you can still add some bricks to the to the building here or even the stonework, right? Because it's a lodge. So you can use the stone stencil on here too. This can be even popped because it's like a um, balcony kind of thing. So you can pop this with the foam tape. And as I said, our design team there, you're going to see so many different ideas to um, see Jackie. You got me. <laughs> I was saying tomorrow on Monday, on Monday, you're going to have different, see different ideas from our design team. Now on the skinny pieces, I like adding glue to the large piece because because um, it's easier than holding the tiny pieces. So these are the parts of the roof right here, just for more, for more dimension. Wendy is asking when this will start shipping. We're gonna start shipping early next week. Um, as you all might be aware, um, there are a lot of delays with manufacturing, with production right now. So we are, we got most of these products in. We're waiting on the clear stem sets and they should be here on Tuesday, I believe. So once we get those in, we're gonna start shipping right away. And we designed this to be more of the winter because we know we're getting close to the holidays, but still some of you will be able to use it, I believe for them. Uh, still for the holidays. 
or you know even if you're if you are done making your Christmas cards this all of these products would would work really great for um, albums right so if you're making some albums look at this this is just so pretty I'm sorry I stopped talking because I'm just like looking at this and of course you know I could have done that right so this is really cute too so if I would put this and just inlay all of the other layers but it's really cute so we called it a ski lodge because this kind of like a, a theme of the of this box right the winter kind of winter um, sports but you know I don't ski, for instance, right? So whenever we go somewhere, if if I even go with people who are skiing or snowboarding, I enjoy my hot cock at the lodge, right? <laughs> so this is really cute. And of course, it doesn't even have to be like a ski lodge. It's just really cute little house that you can use for, not just for winter, for, yeah, Jackie sent like chalet, right? So you can use it for, for, for different holidays and for, um, throughout the year, I believe. So this is really cute. Okay, what else? That's not all yet because there is still more to come. So we have our dice. You get this third die as your gift from us to say thank you for your pre-orders because we appreciate you. Okay, so one more thing is in here and I saved this for last because I am in love with it. And I'm, well, I'm in love with all of this, everything, but this new background stamp set called Winter Needs, I am, like, this is, this is just beyond words amazing. So, as you know, our Kathy saying summer cabin, yes, summer cabin could be, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's just a little house that you can use for any holidays. So this stamp set, as you can see the design here, and it comes with one, two, three, four, five, six other elements. And as you might know, our uh, background stems are rubber stems, and they are the same quality as our image rubber stems. Um, I'm looking at the questions. Esmeralda asking um, if I can post the, the colors I used on Marcy. Yes, I'll do that once we're done with the video. Um, I can do that or I can even just tell you the colors written. No, I'll, I'll write them later. I'll write them later. So the background, the main background, oh, where was I? So the stem, <laughs> sorry, the stem comes on plastic like this. And this is really great for storing it. So you have all of the little pieces here as well. And then what I do, and you might have seen me do that already so many times, but I actually cut my plastic apart. And then when I use my background image, I can just take it like this. And then when I need to use the smaller ones, Somebody's saying hiya under Lala and Cross, and I don't know if it's Eric or if it's Christina or if it's anybody else who has the uh, the admin privileges. So um, Lala and Crafts, whoever you are there, you should identify yourself and say hello to us all. Okay, so this this little images here also have this needed background and we didn't do the sentiment this time because i wanted to include all of these awesome elements for you all and um let me show you really quick now let me move this out of the way right here so when i use the background stamp and you might have seen me do that already but i kind of wanted to um show again um i like using oxide inks versus Oh, hey, it's Marta, okay. <laughs> Hi, Marta. So um, I like using oxide inks versus distress inks because they're more chalky and they give more coverage to the background stamp. And you can just kind of rub over it because this one has a lot of design. So just try to give as much coverage as you want. I mean, even, even if it doesn't come out perfect, like if there's some parts that I didn't ink enough. I still love the effect because it just looks a little different, right? So then I'll take my paper, 
ignore the back of it. <laughs> then I put it front side down and then I'll grab scrap piece of paper. And this is just like printer paper, just thin, thin paper. And then I rub into it. So this is the way I use the, the background stamps. So instead of taking the stamp and turning it down to the paper, this is, this is the easiest way to do it. And you don't need the, the block or you don't need the stamping platform. And look at this, look just how absolutely gorgeous this print is. And look, isn't it awesome? I mean, like, look at this. <laughs> I'm just in, I'm in love. I'm so, so, so in love. And I have this one here in kind of in a gray color. So you can see, you can just use different color and it will just look absolutely gorgeous in any, any color. Look how just, uh, I, I can't get over it. I just can't get over how just gorgeous this background stamp is. So, um, and once again, you didn't hear it here. You didn't hear it coming from me, but if you are one of our club Lalaland subscribers, and if you are not, you probably want to be <laughs> because this background stamp, if you're going to get this, will go so, so nicely with the December club kit. I'm not giving much away, right? But just so you know, and of course, then there are these little elements here and I had them stamped already. So look at this border and you just, you can just continue the design, right? You can use it. You can use it however you want. You can just, you know, like you can put this in the same color, just keep on adding different elements. You can just do like this and have Marcy sitting. Look how beautiful. It just so, so pretty. I mean, isn't it awesome? It's just so simple, but so, so pretty. And this is just this little border that comes in um, with the background stem set. And then we have reindeer, snowman, um, little flower, and and the, the kind of like a Christmas tree. So what I did here, I just stemmed the, the flower, I guess, right here. I've been playing. I've been playing, but look, you can just do this and then you can add the flowers to the border. It's so pretty. Here's this, how the snowman looks like, I wanted to show you. See how it has the, that stitching, stitch detail or um, knitted rather, not stitched, knitted. And this deer, I love them. This reindeer, look how gorgeous they are. So I stamped the border and the bottom and then just lined up the deer and you can do the whole long border. Um, you can just mix and match all of these designs and create your own elements, whatever calls for your project. Isn't this amazing? So this background stem set, if you didn't pre-order, if you did pre-order the box, don't worry because this background stem set will be released on Monday. It will be part of our regular release on Monday. So um, let me just go through this really quick one more time to show you if you just now joining in what's included in this box. So we have our rubber stamp, our Marcy rubber stamp, and she is the full size like this. This is Marcy. Then we have our background stamp set, Winter Needs, that comes with the stamp and the elements. Then we have two clear stamp sets. One is Winter Bears, and another one is Piggies, that's called Dashing Through. Then we have three dies, two dies that are included in the box, and the third die is the bonus die, our gift to you for, for pre-orders, to say thank you for pre-ordering. Um, so we have the ski lift, we have ski lodge and the skis. Then we have layering stencil set, and it comes a set of two. We have the rocks or the stones, cobblestones, and then we have bricks here. So this, you get two stencils. 
And then we have a paper pack. This is the sampler paper pack. The, um, let me see. <laughs> let me see. Let me see if I can find now the, the front of this paper pack. Okay, here it is. So this is Home for Christmas from Home for, for Christmas paper pack. So the, um, you get the sampler. So you get one of each papers of all the 12 different designs that come in the um, Home for Christmas paper pack. So that's what you're going to get. For those of you who pre-ordered, we are going to start shipping early next week or as soon as, as we get the, the clear stamps in. We're not gonna hold it because we know you've been waiting and we know it's getting close to Christmas. So if you still need to make some Christmas gifts and things like that, I hope you'll still have time. And our design team is using this product along with the other um, stamps and dies um, that will be released on Monday. So please come back on Monday and see what else we have to show you because we're excited. <laughs> I hope you guys love it. I hope um, you like what you pre-ordered and thank you so much again for pre-ordering. I mean, we are humbled and we are so happy and appreciative of, of all of you um, for trusting us time after time with these boxes. We love doing this for you. We love releasing the boxes. We do it four times a year. So if you, by some reason, by some chance missed on this box, as I said, the products will be added to our regular range on Monday. We usually don't do it that fast, but because it's um, seasonal, so we're, we're um, trying to push it and do it as, as soon as we can. So for those of you who did pre-order, you'll be able to order these products um, in our regular range on Monday. And then in January, I'm not giving you the date yet because um, there are delays with production right now. So as soon as we hear from our manufacturers, the dates when the products will be available to ship to us, um, we'll post the pre-orders uh, for the next box and I can kind of tell you, I think I can tell you what the theme of the next box is and it's going to be, um, it's going to be uh, birthdays or it's celebrations. So the next box, it will be birthdays and celebrations. So that can be used for, of course, you can use it all year round for years to come. So be on the lookout for that box and make sure you don't miss out. The best way to do is to join our Lala and Crafts fan group because we always um, announce there first to our fans and friends and, and fans <laughs> in our group. Um, I'm looking at some questions. The best box ever, thank you so much. Yes, so um, Barbara, you love the, the birthday theme. Yes, birthday theme will be awesome. And um, for those of you who, who were a part of our retreat, um, there'll be new products in the box. So boxes always have new products. So it's nothing will be there. Um, even if you used, if you used some of the birthday new products in the, um, in the retreat, um, the box will be new, 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 not, not, not yet shown anywhere. So um, once again, thank you so very much and um, be on the lookout on Monday, which is not <laughs> tomorrow, <laughs> tomorrow is Sunday. So one, two more sleeps and you'll see, and you will see everything. Elizabeth is asking when the monthly kit, the, we, um, we are done shipping the monthly kits. If you didn't receive Elizabeth, if you didn't receive your shipment notification, send me a private message and I'll look, look at it um, for you. Or you can go into your account and see there. Brenda is asking when we start mailing this out. Um, Brenda, we're gonna try to do it as soon as we can next week. Um, we said December 2nd, that was on the description of the box and um, I'm not sure if we're gonna if we'll be able to do it that way, but um, maybe December fourth. But look for your be on the lookout for your shipment notification emails. Once we get 
once we get all of the products in we're going to start shipping right away we're not going to be waiting because we know you are all waiting for this so um so yeah so once we get them in uh, next week but by, by uh, you know um I'm saying early next week, but it could be Tuesday, Wednesday, maybe even Thursday. So as soon as we get them, as soon as we get the products in, the rest of the products, we're waiting on more of the clear stem sets. They're gonna, they're gonna be coming your way. We are not holding them back. So once again, thank you so very much. Um, if you're just now joining in, this video will stay so you can watch it over again um, once it's uh, the live is over. And if you um, pre-order this box, thank you very much. If you missed out on the pre-orders, I'm so very sorry we are sold out, but be on the lookout for the new boxes coming next year. Thank you all, love you all, stay safe, bye.